pick a paint color for your room, it can be daunting at times with so many choices. But I'm going to share the secrets on where to start and how to create a home that flows. Hey, Tori here with ToriSoap.com, the place to be to create a home buyers or anyone for that matter will find irresistible. Ever wonder why walking into a model home feels so good? Well, it has to do with color. When choosing a color palette, decide on three to five colors based on a color you love. Maybe it's derived from a color you're stuck with or how you want the overall space to feel. You could choose colors based on the same hue. We used a monochromatic color scheme in our kitchen, playing with neutrals and varying shades of green in the cabinets, tile, and fabric. A harmonious color palette creates a relaxing, calm feel because the colors are made from one another. We played with this right here in our living room using blues, greens, and neutrals. Or you can choose colors that stand alone, have high contrast, and complement one another because they're opposite on the color wheel. Our office has a complementary color scheme mixing yellows, coral, and teal with neutrals to create a burst of color. Let me know in the comment section below what's your favorite color. Now, when choosing a color, it's important to look at the fixed materials already in a room. Maybe it's the cabinetry, tile, or flooring. You want to look at the color and decide if the base color has a red, green, blue, or yellow undertone. Then you want to match the material's undertone with either a cool blue or green or warm yellow or red undertone in a paint swatch. Here's a trick. Always look at the darkest shade on the paint swatch to determine what undertones are going to show up even in the lightest shades. Now that we have the perfect color, what about the sheen? Go for a high gloss or semi gloss in high traffic areas like kitchens and baths for easy cleanup and durability while choosing a flat or matte finish in a bedroom. Click on the iCard above to get more paint information in this week's blog post and you can always find more free resources over at www.toritoke.com. And don't forget to subscribe below to our channel for more quick tips. Until next time, happy painting.